Choosing between a male or female dog is a common dilemma for prospective pet owners. While it might seem like a minor detail, the sex of your dog can influence their behavior, personality, and even health. In today's video, we're diving deep into the key differences between male and female dogs, so you can make an informed decision about which might be the best fit for your home and lifestyle. Whether you're a first-time dog owner, considering adding another furry friend to your family, or already have a beloved pet, understanding these differences can help you strengthen your bond and make informed decisions for your dog's well-being. Physical differences. Let's start with the basics. Physical differences. Generally, male dogs tend to be larger and more muscular than female dogs of the same breed. They often have more prominent physical features such as broader heads and chests. Females, on the other hand, are usually smaller and lighter, with a more refined appearance. However, these differences can vary greatly depending on the breed. For instance, a male Chihuahua might be smaller than a female Labrador. It's essential to consider these physical characteristics when choosing a dog, especially if you have space constraints or prefer a dog of a particular size. Behavioral differences. Behavioral differences between male and female dogs are often what most people focus on when deciding which sex to choose. Let's become more specific. One, temperament. Male dogs are often described as more outgoing and playful. They tend to be more social and may bond closely with all family members rather than favoring just one person. Females, on the other hand, can be more independent and sometimes a bit more reserved. They often bond deeply with one person in the household, becoming fiercely loyal and protective. Two, aggression. There's a common belief that male dogs are more aggressive than females, but this is not always true. While unneutered males can exhibit territorial or dominance-related aggression, this behavior can be significantly reduced through neutering and proper training. Female dogs, especially unspayed ones, may become aggressive when protecting their young or during certain phases of their reproductive cycle. Three, trainability. Some believe that female dogs are easier to train because they tend to mature faster than males. This faster maturity can lead to better focus during training sessions. However, males are often eager to please and can be just as trainable with consistent, positive reinforcement methods. The key to training any dog, regardless of sex, is patience and consistency. Health considerations. Health is another crucial factor to consider when deciding between a male and female dog. One, reproductive health. Male dogs, particularly if left unneutered, are prone to issues related to their reproductive organs, such as testicular cancer or prostate problems. Neutering can eliminate these risks and often curbs unwanted behaviors like roaming or marking territory indoors. Female dogs face their own set of health concerns. Unspayed females are at risk for pyometra, a severe uterine infection, and mammary tumors. Spaying a female dog before her first heat cycle can greatly reduce the risk of these conditions. 2. Lifespan There's a slight tendency for female dogs to live longer than males, but the difference is generally minimal and varies by breed. Proper care, diet, and regular veterinary checkups are far more influential in determining your dog's lifespan than their sex. Living with a male dog Living with a male dog can be a joy, but it comes with its own set of considerations. 1. Social behavior Male dogs are typically very social and enjoy being the center of attention. They may be more prone to displaying behaviors like marking their territory, which can be managed with early training and neutering. 2. Energy levels Males often have high energy levels and enjoy physical activities like running, fetching, or rough play. This makes them a great choice for active families or individuals who love outdoor activities. 3. Interaction with other dogs Unneutered males can sometimes be more challenging around other male dogs due to dominance issues. However, with proper socialization and training, many male dogs can get along well with other pets. Living with a female dog Female dogs also offer unique qualities that might appeal to certain owners. 1. Protective nature Female dogs, especially after they've been spayed, can be very nurturing and protective of their families. 
This makes them excellent companions for households with children. 2. Independence Females are often more independent and may not require as much constant attention as males. This can be a plus for owners who prefer a pet that is affectionate but not overly needy. 3. Heat cycles If not spayed, female dogs will go through heat cycles, which can bring behavioral changes and the need for extra care to prevent unwanted pregnancies. Spaying your female dog can eliminate these issues entirely. The importance of neutering and spaying Neutering and spaying are critical decisions that significantly impact both your dog's health and behavior, as well as your experience as a dog owner. Understanding the benefits and potential consequences of these procedures can help you make the best choice for your pet. 1. Health Benefits Neutering male dogs involves the removal of the testes, which eliminates the risk of testicular cancer and significantly reduces the likelihood of prostate issues including prostate cancer and benign prostatic hyperplasia, enlargement of the prostate. For female dogs, spaying involves the removal of the ovaries and uterus, which prevents uterine infections, like pyometra, and greatly reduces the risk of mammary gland tumors, which are common and often malignant if they occur. Without spaying, female dogs go through regular heat cycles, typically every six months. During these periods, they are more vulnerable to developing certain infections, and if not carefully monitored, there's a risk of unwanted pregnancies, leading to more stray animals or the need for rehoming puppies. Additionally, the hormonal changes during heat can cause mood swings and increase stress for both the dog and owner. 2. Behavioral Changes Neutering and spaying also play a vital role in shaping your dog's behavior. Neutered male dogs often display a significant reduction in aggressive behaviors and territorial marking. This can make them easier to manage, especially in multi-pet households or around other male dogs. Neutering can also decrease the likelihood of roaming behaviors, which are common in intact males driven by the instinct to seek out females in heat. This, in turn, reduces the risk of your dog getting lost or injured while wandering. For female dogs, spaying eliminates the behavioral changes associated with heat cycles, such as restlessness, frequent urination, and increased vocalization. These behaviors can be challenging to manage and might cause frustration for the owner. Spaying also reduces the likelihood of dominance-related behaviors that can sometimes arise in intact females. 3. Impact on the owner For dog owners, deciding to neuter or spay is not just about health and behavior. It's about creating a more harmonious living environment. Neutered or spayed dogs often become more focused and easier to train, as they are less distracted by the drive to mate. This can enhance the bond between you and your dog, making daily interactions and training sessions more rewarding. Additionally, neutering and spaying can lead to fewer stressors and potential conflicts within the household. Intact dogs, especially males, can be more prone to behavioral issues that require consistent management and sometimes even professional training. By opting for these procedures, you can mitigate many of these concerns, leading to a calmer, more predictable pet. 4. Consequences of not neutering or spaying Choosing not to neuter or spay your dog can have long-term consequences. Intact males may continue to exhibit aggressive behaviors, territorial marking, and a strong desire to roam which can lead to accidents or confrontations with other animals. For intact females, the risk of reproductive health issues increases with age, and the challenge of managing heat cycles becomes an ongoing concern. Moreover, the decision not to spay or neuter contributes to the larger issue of pet overpopulation. Unintended pregnancies can result in puppies that may struggle to find homes, adding to the number of dogs in shelters. Neutering and spaying are essential considerations for any responsible dog owner. These procedures not only promote your dog's long-term health, but also enhance their behavior, making them easier and more enjoyable to live with. By making this choice, you're not only ensuring a healthier life for your pet, but also contributing to a more responsible approach to pet ownership. Discuss with your veterinarian the best timing for neutering or spaying your dog to maximize these benefits. In the end, whether a male or female dog is right for you depends on your lifestyle, preferences, and the specific traits you value in a pet. Both male and female dogs can be loyal 
loving, and wonderful companions when given proper care and training. By understanding the differences and considering the needs of each sex, you can make an informed decision that will lead to a happy and harmonious relationship with your new furry friend. Thanks for joining us in this exploration of the differences between male and female dogs. Whether you're leaning towards one or the other, the most important thing is the love and care you provide. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell for more insights on caring for your pets. And if you have any questions or experiences to share, drop them in the comments below. We'd love to hear from you.